Hi, I'm Sean Gannett, and this is Minute Math, and today we're going to learn about properties of logarithms. We're going to condense each expression to a single logarithm. So, if I was given this, the natural log of x minus 4 natural log of y. Well, when I'm condensing this, I see that 4 that's right up front. I'm going to put that as the power of the y, which we can do. So we have the natural log of x minus the natural log of, well, y to the fourth power. Now, we both have these logs, or both log base e, right, the natural log. And so we condense them together with that subtraction becoming a division. So we have natural log now of x divided by what we have here, y to the fourth power. And that's it. This is our final answer. So let's recap. We're given natural log of x minus 4 natural log of y. The 4 out front of the natural log of y, I wrote as the exponent of the y is one of our property, our rules, our properties of logarithms. Then when we condense this, that subtraction separating two logarithms can become a division of the variables itself, or whatever, whatever particular logs of, or natural log in this case. <coughs> so we write this as one big logarithm, and again, the final answer is just natural log of x divided by y to the 